District Attorney Carrie Brandenburg says her office was told to leave the scene of last night's shooting because she just charged two officers with murder. Brandenburg's prosecutors have been allowed on every other shooting scene under an agreement with APD. But now APD says there's a big conflict of interest. News 13's Chris McKee spoke to both sides today. He's live at the DA's office with more. Chris. Yeah, Jessica Brandenburg says this has never happened before. For more than a decade, her office has been allowed at every single officer involved shooting seen as part of the investigation team. But last night, a city attorney called her and said that can't happen anymore because she just charged two officers with murder. Now, here's a clip of that phone conversation. But our concern is if your agency has basically said they're going to take these cases to prelims, um, then having them sit in these briefings changes the review by your office. The person sitting in there is a witness. The mayor's office says the conflict of interest stems from the James Boyd case. The same district attorney who reviewed the Boyd shooting seen the day it happened is the same district attorney now filing charges against officers Dominic Perez and St. Keith Sandy. As a result of that phone call, Brandenburg's officer wasn't a part of the police shooting investigation last night. Brandenburg says she not only she says not only does that violate an agreement the city and prosecutors signed onto, but also the Department of Justice's agreement with the city. It calls for Brandenburg's office to continue to help investigate officer involved shootings. The city says it now wants to change the agreement and get a special prosecutor to investigate every police shooting. This creates a level of transparency for our officers to understand that the same prosecutor sitting in the pre-briefing won't be the same prosecutor indicting them or potentially indicting them. If for them to say we have a conflict of interest um, because we work with them um, or for whatever reason because we decided to pursue the Boyd case and that was the reason given last night basically means that they are above the law. Now, Brandenburg just sent a letter to, or excuse me, the city just sent a letter to Brandenburg this evening um, to start the dialogue of changing their officer involved shooting protocols. Brandenburg has yet to respond. Back to you. All right, thank you. Now, is it a conflict of interest for a DA to prosecute a police department they work closely with? A New Mexico lawmaker thinks so. Representative Mimi Stewart of Albuquerque has filed this bill asking the legislature to require the attorney general to investigate or prosecute any felony cases involving an officer instead of the DA. We asked the governor for her opinion. In an email, her spokesman said district attorneys are typically able to handle these types of cases well and always have the discretion to utilize other DAs or the attorney general when there is a true conflict of interest.